Let me have my rectangle over there. Thanks. These things here, these are addictive rectangles. They're designed to be addictive. And so they're hard to put down and set over here and not look at. It doesn't, no my wife has no problem with it. <laughs> doesn't mean that you can't set them down and walk away from them. Oh, but I'm waiting on, you know, Billy John to text me. And well, okay, well, they'll still be there. And part of that, of the interconnectedness of today's society is that old adage of failure to plan on your part does not constitute an emergency on my part. There's a lot of people that reach out to me with shit that they need handled right now. And I don't always immediately respond. And when I don't <clears throat> immediately respond because stimulus pause response, when I do respond uh, eight out of 10 times, that immediate problem that nobody could solve but me has been handled. Yep. Good. 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 One less thing I got to worry about. And that's maybe a, un a more unique challenge for me than others because I'm mayor of Bear Camp and pastor and CEO and president. And so I get a lot of people that contact me about a lot of things every day. But I made that bed. And I can unmake that bed or I can pick a different bed as well. And if you empower the people who hierarchically are underneath you and the leadership structure to do their damn jobs and teach them when things like that come up. If they have an emergency now and you just solve it for them, the next time they have an emergency, they're going to reach out to you too. But if you teach them how to deal with that emergency, the next time you see they see that thing, they don't have to get with you on how do I deal with this because they've got some reps. They already know how to deal with it. Shalom.